the Peterborough Chase will kick off day two of week six. We're at Huntingdon for this one. It's a grade two, two and a half mile up. And at the top we've got the mighty for Joshua Sutherland, Enzo Zancaro, Darren Thompson, Kingdom Come, Daniel French, Police Run, Leon Van Rensburg, Rule Supreme, David Hooley, Signpost, Craig Beckwith, Stitch in Time, Graham Clitterbuck, The Blank, Joshua Sutherland, Venadome, Darren Thompson, Alien Captain, Leon Van Rensburg, Ellie's Politan and Hellvelin Runs for David Robertson, Lady Bolt for David Hooley and what a deal for Craig Beckwith, a field of 14 then in this two and a half mile grade two event. Called in and away in the obligatory rain and alien captain was the first to show but now it's going to be stitch in time looks like it's going to go on stitch in time alien captain then kingdom come just tucked in behind them and the Darren Thompson pair together Venado and Enzo Zancaro as they get to the first of the 16 and they all get over it safely with the mighty that just being dropped to the back of the pack so they're coming down to the second which is the water and they're all safely over that one as well. With stitching time now, three lengths clear. And uh, settled down into, a into an uncontested lead. With the blank showing in second as they get to the third. And they're all safely over the third, although Lady Bolt was a little bit untidy. And also, David Hooley's other one, Rule Supreme, didn't jump it that well either. And they're now both at the back. And they get over the fourth. And uh, this time, Rule Supreme again gave it a bit of a wallop. And has now been overtaken by his stable mate. But at the front end, it's stitching time for Graham Clutterbuck, who leads into fence five. Stood off that one, but got over it okay. They all jumped it nicely. With signpost now in second. Then Alien Captain third ends as Zankara after that one. Kingdom Come, what a deal. The Black and the Mighty have moved up considerably as well. Stitch in time. In the lead. What is it? Is it a stitch in time? Saves nine or something, is it? I've got, not got a clue what that means. It doesn't make any sense at all to me, if it's even right. As they get to the sixth, they're all safely over it. And their police run has been relegated to the back. But stitch in time is in the lead from the mighty in second. Signpost is third and the blank. And what a deal in Zankara after that one as they take the seventh. So again, I'll get over nicely. Getting quite strung out now. And this leader is something to think about as they come up past the stands. They'll have a complete circuit left ahead of them when they get past the winning post, which they will do so very soon. There you go, stitching time past it in the lead this time round with the mighty in second and then Venadome in third. Signpost is four and then Captain is five. Then what a deal is six and then Kingdom Come as they get over. Number eight, which they again all safely get over. Ellie's Politan has now dropped towards the back as they get over the next. A mistake there by Signpost. I've seen that one shuffle down the pack a little bit as well. But it's stitching time still in front from the mighty in second. Venadome travelling nicely in third. Kingdom comes, but in the first four all the way. Then Alien Captain and the Blank. There's a gap of about four lengths or so then to signpost as we go from that mistake and rule supreme who's now going a lot better than he was doing early on after that one in zankara and police run now getting back into it what a deal uh, it's dropped back a bit and then lady bolt and finally ellie's politan as they all stream over the water for the second and final time we get down towards the business end of the race then now less than seven furlongs still to go and stitching time will lead you to this plain fence gets over it nicely from the mighty in second and then kingdom come third venadome is back in fourth and comes the blank and signpost as they take the 13th and stitching time really attack that one got away from it well with just three fences to go then now and stitching time is a good four lengths clear still from venadome in second kingdom come is in third then alien captain now making a forward and stitching time a bit slower at that one as the blank now starts to make its challenge and comes through into second but it's stitching time in the lead the blank in second venadome third alien captain four then kingdom come and the mighty police runs after that then a bit of a gap to signpost they're racing down now and towards the final two and it's stitching time who's still in the lead been in the lead all the way still leads by a good three to four lengths from the blank in second then comes alien captain and 
police run on the outside. Venado in Kingdom coming next. And then the mighty signpost is trying to get into it. So to Zenzo, Zancaro and Lady Bot as they come down towards the second last. And Stitching Time is over it in the lead. Stitching Time is still clear by three or four to Kingdom Come, who's now gone into second. Police run on the blanker next. Here's the final fence then. And they get over it. And Stitching Time lands in the lead. And he's still three clear. And Stitching Time into the final third. Oh, looks like he might maintain this lead right the way up to the line. He's beginning to tire, but he's hanging on. He's still two to three lengths clear as they race up towards the line. It's going to be Stitching Time who's going to hang on and take it. Pillar to post win from the fast finishing police run in Kingdom coming out and Captain Lady Bolt finished well. And Lord Supreme was the last one to finish. That was not much of a race in the end because Lord to um, Stitching Time just led from start to finish. And they never got a blow in anybody. So Stitching Time takes it for Graham Clutterbuck. Police Run was second for Leon van Rensburg. Kingdom Come for Daniel French was third. Alien Captain Leon van Rensburg fourth. And Venadome for Darren Thompson was fifth.